It's extremely important to realize that the idea that science alone produces true knowledge is very dangerous, and here's why. We give people authority to act in public because we assume they have the relevant knowledge. Dentists cannot put their hands in our mouths, but not insurance salesmen, because the dentist, we assume, doesn't just have a bunch of very deep emotional beliefs about molars, we assume that he actually knows something about molars. And so we give people the, the right to write our contracts, to sell houses, to operate on us, and so on, because we attribute to them not a bunch of beliefs, but knowledge of the relevant subject. If you limit knowledge to science, then all of the important questions of life, is there a God, is there a soul, is there life after death, is there right and wrong, and what is right and what is wrong, what should the state do and what should be out of bounds for the state to do, who ought I vote for, what should education be like, these are all questions that can't be answered by science because they're ought questions, normative questions. What that means is, if science is the sole source of knowledge we have of reality, all the things that matter to us most are left in the area of emotion, and it will turn out then that the makeup man is more important than the speechwriter.